Gregorian chant, the soul of sacred music, and the body of the music you'll hear today on our program, Sacred Soundings, music to deepen your faith beyond measure. I'm Al Romano, your host for Sacred Soundings, on listener-supported St. Gabriel Catholic Radio AM820, and streaming live on stgabrielradio.com. Eastern Orthodox Christians were the first to refer to Lent as the season of bright sadness. It's a provocative phrase that has now been embraced by Christian spiritual leaders and writers of all denominations. Bright sadness is a paradox, an oxymoron, yet it uniquely captures the mood of the Lenten season, a time of both sorrow and celebration, of deep remorse for our sins and anticipation of radiant joy at Christ's resurrection. Bright sadness suggests a range of commingled and conflicted feelings. No music covers that spectrum of feelings like Gregorian chant. And we'll begin today with chants by the Benedictines of Mary, Queen of Apostles. First, Ave Verum, Hail True Body, chanted immediately after the consecration in the churches of medieval Europe. It will be followed by Jesus, my Lord, my God, my all, and Misericordios Domini. Forever I will sing the mercies of the Lord.
You're listening to Sacred Soundings, a production of St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20, and I'm your host, Al Romano. We just heard Hail True Body, Jesus, my Lord, my God, my all, and Forever I Will Sing the Mercies of the Lord, from the album Adoration at Ephesus, by the Benedictines of Mary, Queen of Apostles. Now, selections by the Carmelite Sisters of the Most Sacred Heart. You have called me, we lift up our eyes to you, and greater things. Oh 
You're listening to Sacred Soundings, a production of St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AM820, and I'm your host, Al Romano. We just heard, You Have Called Me, We Lift Up Our Eyes to You, and Greater Things, from the CD, Journey Home, by the Carmelite Sisters of the Most Sacred Heart. We'll close with chants by the Scola Cantorum of the Dominican House of Studies in Washington. We'll hear Felix Mendelssohn's Beate Mortui, Blessed Are the Souls, and Adoramaste Christe, We Adore Thee, Christ.
You're listening to Sacred Soundings, a production of St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20. We just heard Blessed Are the Souls and We Adore Thee, Christ, by the friars of the Dominican House of Studies in Washington. It's often said that humility is the prize of all virtues and the key to obtaining all the others. Pride is the antithesis of humility, and it stands squarely in the way of our advancing in the virtues. It's pure pride that tempts us to think we would have stood firmly with Jesus throughout his passion and death. But humility assures us that we would likely have fallen asleep as our Lord agonized and prayed for deliverance in the garden, and would just as likely have denied knowing him as he silently accepted his death sentence. Throughout this holy season of bright sadness, may God grant us many opportunities to grow in humility and the grace to embrace them all. I'm Al Romano, your host for Sacred Soundings on St. Gabriel Catholic Radio, AMA 20. Join us Wednesdays at noon and Sundays at 9.30 a.m. and 2.30 p.m. for more Sacred Soundings, music to deepen your faith beyond measure.